Hello everyone, I am the Flesh 3004. Welcome back to Planet Crafter. Thank you for taking the time to hang out with me. I always enjoy having you here with me. Welcome back to the channel. We are terraforming a planet, as you know, and we went way over there. There's kind of that dark blue marker right there. We went way over there, and we finally found that base that's in amongst that yellow area. And I was talking with my friend about this this game because he has played it. And when we went around the corner, we went into that sulfuric area of, I guess, that's way over there. When we go to that ship and then go to the left, there's a yellow area. That's where we went to. And then, of course, we went to a different area also and found some new cool stuff. So I thought that was very interesting. I wanted to show you something real quick before we continue on our way. If we come up here into the room here, I think it's a bio lab or something like that. And if we go to here, we can see that we're at 145 and the plants rocket will be opening up at 175. That's coming up really quick. The plants are coming up fast and things are going pretty good right now. And then at 500, we'll get the flower spreader. And I have no idea what the T here is. I just don't know. It's kind of probably got to do something with the insects or whatever. So we're going to have to go and figure out exactly what that is. Because underneath all of this stuff, there is nothing with a T. So that's just something I'm just going to have to try to figure out as we go. I did put a bunch of oxygen away. We were in that base, and every time we went in, we would get oxygen capsules. So we have a whole bunch of those down there, and we have like five of them on us, just in case, you know, something happens. What I want to do is do a little more exploring and go look at another area that we have been in, but we probably need to go see if maybe we can collect some more resources from there and maybe build another extractor we'll see what all happens i just gotta figure out where we're going and what we're doing that's gonna be the biggest thing it's like our lake here is definitely filling up a lot i think that's pretty awesome that we have a nice big lake here with a little island right there that's cool that's cool so we have our thing here i want to go see what is in here before we go a little bit farther because we might be able to go that way a little ways huh Okay, cool. Looks like we're getting lots of basic materials, which I'm not too terribly worried about. I should make another chest or two or three there. But first, we haven't been back here at all, so I want to go see. This is just melted away enough that we can come back here. I didn't even know this is melted, but it looked like it was, so we're in new area. How do you like that? There's lots of sulfur back here. Maybe we should just go and pick up sulfur because we're going to be needing it soon anyway. just want to do some running around back in this area. We'll probably use an oxygen that we have or two. We just got to go see what the heck is back here. I do like this area. I just don't know what all is back here and what all we're going to be able to do, you know, because maybe it's just this little area and nothing else, which... Oh, no, that was Osmium. I thought that was that other blue stuff, Cobalt. I was pretty sure that was going to be Cobalt. So we found more Osmium. All right. Cool. So I have a little pedestal rock here. I think that's pretty cool or whatever you want to call it. Plateau rock. Well, this is a nice little area back here. We do have a bit of sulfur and some Osmium. That's good. And, of course, quite a bit of iridium, but I'm not really too worried about that right now. We can get iridium. I mean, you know, obviously there's quite a bit back here. This goes back out here. Okay, cool. I wasn't exactly too sure. Wait. Wait. We're in a different area. Where? Oh, okay. Now I know where we are. Okay, this is fascinating that we came through that cave and it ended up back over here in this kind of nighttime area, you could say, because that's kind of what it is, you know. We have been here. We have found quite a bit of that white, 
stuffing here and looks like there's several crates we are taking that that and you know what we probably should take the aluminum and we're gonna leave that stuff right now we can always come back here if we need to I don't want to travel too far in here I know we can't go terribly far anyway but I want to make sure that we can find our way back and it's raining again in here okay that's cool taking the super alloy I can tell you that much right now that's good There's plenty of iridium I just don't know I think is that osmium that's osmium all right we're gonna take osmium that's for sure that's just cobalt that's the other stuff that I was thinking it what it was back there but that was not it was, it was already um osmium titanium there's some more cobalt okay so we just came out into, into a area that we have been in before but i didn't even know that this was here i mean i guess it does make sense but i didn't even know so this there's that plateau rock okay there's our extractor okay that's what I was wondering yeah so if we go that way we go all the way out there so we do have a faster way to get out there now okay that's cool all right nothing else back here has opened up all right that's cool there's nothing else back here to open up that I know of but at least we do know we can get back into that area relatively easy now. All right. Well, we just did something new. Maybe not new, new, but, you know, new-ish. Let's go back here. I want to get some more food and water anyway. How much room do we have? Not a lot. Let's go drop osmium and different things. And we can... Oh, wow, that chest is up. That's cobalt that chest is full and we do have a little bit more of that we're definitely starting to get low on this kind of stuff so gotta do kind of watch out trying to get things a little organized put the aluminum away and then we have some more iron that i think there's one nope not one slot there i am thinking about doing something also a little bit different i'm thinking about taking these heaters here and building another room maybe out here maybe even having another stairway up above and putting all the heaters like in there maybe above this room and then we can have them in there and we can continue putting in like lockers and everything face lockers back to back right down this area here and also this area here and of course lining the walls up to here and then having a lot of lockers in here and i think that would be good we can line this thing with lockers of course put in a ladder and all that stuff but yes that's what i've been thinking about doing i was thinking about it earlier while i was at work and was just kind of like you know that kind of seems like a good idea okay sulfur is completely full what we're gonna have to do is find a place to put sulfur where we can put a bunch of it wow we have a lot of okay we have a lot of stuff man but we're gonna be needing it and i know that we are so let's go out let's go get some more water save our water for when we're, when we're out and about and we really need it we'll put a, quite a few of these away maybe we'll see about doing a little bit more stuff with you know algae and different things like that but as far as i know right now we're just not going to we're going to gather a little bit of food we'll get some of that put away here put that away put that away and then we'll probably have another let's have a bean this time just to make sure that we're really nice and full like okay we're at 172. We're almost ready to open up the plants rocket. That's going to be awesome. That's going to be awesome. So it looks like we're going to be doing pretty good. We're going to be opening up quite a bit of stuff. That's going to open up here real soon. That's awesome. 
What I'm probably gonna do, let's go to Q. I wanna build that room before we get too terribly far and we get busy. So let me go see what it's gonna take. It is gonna take three iron, two ti three titanium, and two super alloy. I hope I can build it up on there, okay. We do have enough stuff in these other chests to be able to do so. Do that, we'll do that and then we'll grab two super alloy and we will go build a room on top of there and then we'll build a ladder and we'll see if we can move those heaters up to there you know we could very easily nice we got it we got it put a room right up here on top of there but maybe we might need that for something i don't know Let's go and stick with the room up here for right now. I think this would be for the best. Let's go to Q. Let's find that large room wherever that is. Okay. Um, why are you not letting me build on top of there? Wait, wait. Had it. Why are you not cooperating, huh? Me. almost let me do it but not quite and I don't really understand what's what's happening here unless maybe I need to put in a ladder first which is always maybe a possibility all right let's go see about putting in a ladder okay cool so let's go grab Unel Cobalt and an iron and let's build a ladder where are we gonna put that ladder I think it's all greenish outside. How do you like that? Let's put that ladder somewhere over here. And then maybe we can build that room right on top of it. And I hope that that will work. Let's put that guy in the corner. I think that would be for the best. Okay, let's go see. I wonder if we can get just up there through here. We can. Cool. Okay. It's all icky out. Icky, 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 icky. There we go. Nope. Um, that is not what I wanted. Let's do this right. And let's get this guy right on top of where I want it. Huh. That little low area there kind of muffles the sound. That's crazy. Who would have ever thought I would have done that? Come on, can you cooperate with me, please? Why are you being so fussy? Let me see if I can get this guy. Been trying for several minutes now to try to get this guy lined up on top of here. And it is not letting me. I can get it on here, but it's raised up a fair amount, so I don't think it's going to work right. And it keeps on going off to the side. It builds it out there. It builds it off to the side here. I can get it close, but I am having one heck of a time. That's about as... See, it keeps on moving all the time, and I don't quite understand why. I can put it right here, and I can build that, but I really don't want it above my area there. I guess if that's what I have to do, I just don't really want to have to do that. And I could put it out on the side of there. But I was hoping to try to get it right on top of here. And for whatever reason, this thing is being a bugger. And I don't quite understand why. I haven't yelled at it yet or anything. I haven't, you know, dated his sister or anything to cause him to be mad at me or anything. But for some reason, he just does not want to cooperate. And I'm... It just will not go on there right. For whatever reason, it is refusing to go on there correct. And so because of that, I'm thinking I might have to have it just over this or even sticking out over here and take out those windows and put those in somewhere else. 
So again, it's just not cooperating anywhere near what I was hoping it would. And it's just it's unfortunate because I was all looking forward to that. And I don't really understand what I'm doing wrong here. I guess I can just go ahead and build that here. Or even on the end of here. And then I'll take out those windows first. And then I'll build it on the end of here. And I'll put those windows in elsewhere and see if we can do it that way because right now I'm just kind of running out of options or maybe I won't I can deconstruct living compartment and I can deconstruct ladder but I cannot deconstruct those windows so I guess whatever we have there we are not going to be able to use and I guess that's just the way it is okay well I guess if that's what we have to do, then that's what we will do. And we'll make it like this. Let me go see. I have some iron. I am going to build support structures just to make it look a bit better. Let me work on that, and then we'll see what this all looks like here in just a quick minute. If you hold down control like I'm doing right now, then you can build multiples of these then you can build more than one and you can have like a array of things that you can put in so that way it looks like you know you can you can put in more than one as what I'm trying to say and it would build them so you don't have to keep on going back to escape all the or, or tab all the time and putting in more of that stuff on a regular basis because you know that's kind of difficult if you know what I mean so I'm just gonna go ahead and let up on control I'll, then I won't build another one of those because I think that's gonna be enough support, at least at least looking support, that that should help that look good. And I see something. Okay, it was that, but over there is a part of the rocket launch platform. When I came over the ladder, I was like, "Wait, why is there why is there a big thing over there?" I totally forgot I built that room. And then I'm like, "Oh yeah, I built the room, huh? Duh. It's okay. I just need help." So what I need to do now is decide if I want to move those guys into this room and have them off to the side and then have like all of my things over here. And we lost, of course, that glass, as you know, in, and just continue the lockers, put one more locker there if it'll do it and continue lockers into here and have a whole bunch of them there thereby creating more room with these. Let's go see about moving this into here and making more of those guys in here. Let me get those guys moved and then we will continue. So I'm just gonna hold down control this time and that should help. And then we can build a bank of these over here on this side and just put them right along this wall. My friend had told me about it and then I completely forgot and it mentioned, meant to mention it to you the last time that I was here, <coughs> excuse me, here and just completely whiffed. So there you go. And once you run out of stuff, then you just can't build them anymore. So we now have four heaters over there. Oh, so much quieter. That's much better. Okay, and then of course we have the tier two heater, which I guess we can always take out this one, and then we can put that tier two heater maybe like over here along this wall or something, or you know, try to figure out a good place for it. Maybe even right along in here and just put him right there. That should work. Okay. So that way all the heaters are in one room and then we don't have to worry about hearing their buzzing all the time. And maybe I will move this, well, I can't really move the ladder. That's going to be kind of a problem. We're just going to have to go around the ladder to get to anything. And if this is the way it has to be, then that's just the way it has to be. So we'll deal with that. All right, let's go over here. We have to eat a piece of food here in a minute, get ourselves a little nourishment. Oh, missed. And let's go up here and go see how much the next rocket's going to be. Because that's going to be something that we're going to have to see about. Plants rocket, magnetic field protection, we know about that. And asteroid attraction, so the plants rocket. 
Okay, two super alloy, rocket engine, a lerma, and a tree bark. You know what? I think... I don't think we have a tree bark, though. <clears throat> Excuse me. Maybe we did. I just don't know let's go see if we have a tree bark if we i think we have the tree seed but we don't have the tree bark and we also got one other thing too while i was trying to build that and i'll show you what that is in a minute what is this okay tree soleus so we do not have a tree bark yet what is that where does that go at does that i don't know where that because that's a tree thing and i don't know if it actually goes inside the oxygenators but there's one more thing that we can build now, too, and that is a biodome tier 2. Oh, see, I told you we need bacteria samples, two fertilizer, and a sulfur, and a super alloy. And let's go see, do we have two fertilizers? Ooh, we. Two fertilizers. Let's add this to the build goal. Is there a way to add that to the build goal? Um, I don't think so. Maybe? Okay, two bacteria, super alloy, sulfur. I thought that we had at least one bacteria. Okay, we have one bacteria there. Now we need to make another bacteria, but I don't remember what that required. So let's go see. Bacteria, we need three algae and three water. Well, you know what? We have lots of algae in here. Let's go ahead and do that. Let's make another bacteria. We have more than enough water. We can go out and get more of that, I am relatively sure. Let's make another bacteria. Okay. We need a sulfur and a super alloy. And we should have sulfur in here. Let's go grab another super alloy. Let's go see if we can make anything in here. Not yet far as all that other stuff goes and let's grab a super alloy and I want to go see where we are going to be able to put that because if we can maybe put that outside of here too I don't know if we're going to be able to let's go take a look let's go to Q let's go to biolab tier 2 and Maybe we have to have a one compartment thing to hook up because it isn't going to do that to this one. I wonder if I could hook up one compartment because if I can, then maybe we can build that. Because Yeah, I don't think it's going to actually be able to let us okay. build. We can build it out here. But I'm thinking that we probably need to attach it to like a building or something and... Let me go see if I can do anything at all like that. Okay, let's go see if we can. Okay, holy moly, that thing's big. So we have another compartment right there. How much is that impeding upon our launch rocket? It's actually right above our launch rocket, which I guess doesn't work out or which works out a little bit well we have some iron let's go build a few of these things here these supports and let's just go and see if we can you know get those in we're going to press control again so we can build a few of these just to make it look like it actually is supporting the structure even though i know it doesn't need to be supporting the structure but if it kind of looks like it is I think that looks better anyway. Kind of makes it look more realistic, you know. Okay. They may not be placed very evenly, but they will work for what they are doing. This one is actually way off. I want to go see if I can do this one a little bit better. There we go. Right like that. Maybe right. Okay. Well, let me do it one more in. So we'll just do it like that. So that way it's resting on it. Now let's go inside and let's go check this out. We do have some water and food. So we're doing okay there. What we're going to have to do is probably go all the way through here. And just go into the ne Ooh, next one. Ooh, pretty. 
Hey, what the heck is container? Tree bark. I wonder. Let's take a tree thing and put that in there. Maybe, maybe that'll help. I don't know. I've never done this before, so I am new to all of this. Let's go see if that actually does anything. I don't know. We'll find out here in a minute. If it doesn't, then I guess I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, it does go in there. Okay. I don't know what it does. I have no idea, and I don't know... Maybe we'll get, like, tree bark, and then we can build something else. But that's the only thing I can think of to do. I'm pretty sure it's going to be making tree bark. But, again, I'll have to wait and see. Or maybe tree bark goes inside of there. Oh, okay, I see. So there's one on either side. Didn't even notice this one. Wow, that's crazy. Um, Let me go see about going back to here and just finding, finding, finding out what we can do here. Okay, we got that. So at 500, which is, wow, the thing's going up fast. We can have a flower spreader, place a seed in this to grow flowers on a small area outside. Okay, let's go to the biodome thing and see if we can find that. That is not there. Let's go to here. Let's go find the biodome mark two or whatever. Okay, I found the biodome tier two and it says generates tree barks. Cool. So that way we can make the tree bark stuff. So yes, this will be generating tree bark. Now I don't know if putting that tree in there is actually going to do anything, but we will see what happens. And I'm hoping that it will make tree bark for us. Maybe that's what that does. I don't know. We'll see if we get a tree bark up there. Maybe we'll take that out and see what happens. I'm going to show you what I did. I actually moved a tit the titanium chest over here. And I'm going to start moving the I'm going to move the iron chest from here to over there. I wonder if having these things in here is what made that not work right above here, which is always a possibility. It just couldn't do it or something. I don't know. It just would not build right. And I'm really kind of beside myself about what to do there because I have no idea. Let me get this out of here. We'll go build a chest over here. And then we will see what all else we can do here. Get this chest in. And I want to go look at something. One one more thing. But I want to move this stuff too. Okay, I got all the iron into there. We now have that thing full. And that's good. Oops, nope, wrong one. That's going to help. And we are getting a little bit full on stuff. Of course, we're... Nowhere near where we could be, but we are expanding our base a little bit. So we have to have tree bark to be able to build the next tier rocket. And that's going to be very interesting. Let's go ahead and gather up these. And that's good. I don't know if we can go into another area or not. I know we went from here into an area but i want to go check this out again and see way back here where this goes because it's been a while since we were back here and i don't recall where this goes i do know a lot of the ice has melted okay that's right it goes back into here this is that yellow area that the other one here goes into that I said I didn't know where we were which is this area here which is way back okay we can't get down there all right so this area here should go out to where we once were not that long ago it looks like there's some more osmium and this should be over by the big ship, if I'm seeing correctly. Yes, it is. Okay. 
All right, and I think it was back over where that dark area is that we ended up back over there also. Let me go take a quick look. All of this is so confusing. Let's go back through here. Let's go back out here, and let's go back over here. So I thought that we ended up out here somewhere, somehow, some way. This is the sandy area. And we know that's where we found all of the super alloy. So that's the big ship. Okay, that's... Wait, there's a chest there? The heck, I didn't know there was a chest here. Well, I guess we're taking all that stuff now, huh? Well, nothing in there. All right, let's look back here for a quick minute. That's okay. I know where that is. We had our base right out there. And if, uh, my, my friend told me that we can... Oh, hey. Um, 150 seed Lerma, we'll take that, we'll take the bio nugget, and then, my friend told me that you can get sulfur back here with the ore extractor, so I think that's something we should definitely be looking into, because that's going to help us out a lot, and now we're low on, aha, oxygen, wait, wait, where are we? Let me... What the heck is going on? Is this the way... Oh, this is over by our area. Okay. This is so confusing! It's pretty awesome, but confusing. Okay, so we have our biodome right here, tier 1. We have our biodome tier 2 right here. Um, I could probably put an entrance on there, but I don't want to build another room just right there because, you know, we're running out of room here. We're running out of space to put things, and maybe I didn't choose the best space possible, but I guess we can see about going up. And I want to also see if I could put one on here since that's mostly empty. And just see if those heaters are somehow messing with everything. But I don't know. I'll try that a little bit later. I'm going to work on clearing stuff. And work on doing some other things. We're at 275. At 500 we get the flower spreader. We already went over this before. And let's go look into here. Tree bark. Awesome. So we do get tree bark. I don't know if we... Let's 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 take this out and let's see what happens. If we don't get any tree bark after a while, or I don't get any tree bark, then we'll know that things are, you know, maybe not like they should be. What I want to do is take out that and keep that on the end. Okay, that way that guy's on the end, so he's easier to find. Lakes are ninety six point. Wow, look at that! It's almost a hundred percent for the lakes or the liquid water the lakes are coming next and that's really really close and it looks like biomass is definitely coming up and pressure and heat and oxygen so yes we're doing pretty good for ourselves the oxygen slowly going up probably need more oxygen plants but we'll see about doing that next time most likely but we did at least get a few things done this is a little wonky, but it works. And I can't put anything. I could probably put small compartments right here. I could put two of those in, I think. But maybe not, because it is acting awfully funky. Maybe what I'm going to have to do is build stuff off of this side. Can't put anything where these rocks are, where this rock is. We might be able to bypass it if we're lucky, but I'm not too sure we're going to be that lucky. We may have to start building stuff out this way, too. We will see what happens as time goes, but I'm hoping that things will work out good for us. We can continue expanding our base because I don't want to have to move everything. That's for sure. 
This is Planet Crafter. Thank you for joining me. I hope you had a wonderful time. I had a pretty awesome time. This was a lot of fun. It was a lot of work, but it was also pretty fun too. So we got to build some more stuff. We will build the rocket now that we have some tree bark. We will build the rocket. We just got to wait for a little bit. Try to get some more tree bark. See if that's going to work. And in the meantime, if you like the video, drop a like on the video. And we will talk to you next time. You have a great day. And we will see you later. Bye-bye.